Yes, Bob, Mike Murdoch at Bozard Lincoln. Once again, I appreciate your patience and time um, as we've worked hard and worked together to make this work and make sure you're totally happy with this vehicle. Uh, this is a very nice package. It's kind of a limited edition because it is what is called the Sport Package, which is an upgrade on kind of the top of the line. So you do have upgraded headlamps, uh, that 360 degree Lincoln Co-Pilot system. Uh, the grill is blacked out to make it look a little sportier. You have a camera underneath the Lincoln emblem, as well as under each side mirror. You get upgraded nicer wheels, and these are uh, Continental tires, one of the high-end models, what they call the Cross LX Sport, and they're like new. So like you said, I know that's one of your concerns. Uh, my clients that on this previously have been clients of mine for over 20 years, so their big thing was all-weather mats and obviously having very good tires and i know that's important especially with the weather in florida and for the ride comfort then you have the panoramic roof uh, which is like kind of a black tinted glass so it accents the silver metallic lincoln calls it silver radiance then you do have the side rails you were asking about and then the trim mirrors and the black pillars which kind of sets it off nicely and very low miles like i said for a 2021 for 10,000 miles and then lincoln upgrade your warranty to six year 100,000 bumper to bumper same key fob similar to your nautilus you do have remote start uh your power lift gate and you can unlock your doors or you can just touch any door uh, with the ridges and you have your five digit code but when you come to the interior this is ebony so you have a nice uh, leather interior it's perforated so the heated and cooled seats especially in florida in the summer the cooled seats are important little newer technology on the corsair which i think you'll like not as many buttons it's actually easier to use you can see the mileage at 10 188 and then they have lincoln all-weather mats um, so the floor is still like brand new as you can see this screen's smaller so with the screen being smaller and tinted, uh, you should not get the glare issues that you were talking about um, that you're actually dealing with, like you said, on the Nautilus. I'm hoping because of the size, um, you'll be happy with that. And then your information buttons are big and easy to find. So one side turns on your cruise control, which makes this light up. And then you have the adaptive cruise not only is it adaptive cruise but uh, i'm trying to get my camera to pick this up it has, has lane centering so when you have the cruise on and you turn on your little steering wheel it will actually drive itself it takes adaptive cruise one step higher so all you gotta do is keep your hands on the wheel this vehicle will drive itself um which you may have on the not unless i can't remember hopefully my camera will pick up the heads up display it may flash different colors because of the camera, but it's kind of a soft white light. But it'll show your speed limit sign, uh, your speedometer, your outdoor temperature. Then you'll have your information screen here. And you can cycle through your fuel economy, uh, plus your other features like your tire pressure. And when they detail it, we make sure your tire pressure, everything is good on the vehicle. Because uh, of the cold weather, sometimes it changes a few pounds, so they get that all taken care of. Um, then you have the heated and cooled seats, which is nice. You'll still have the push button, um, but they are big, and they're located down below that um, middle screen, so they're easy to use. So hopefully you'll be okay with that. Uh, the other nice feature that you don't have on the Nautilus are these drive modes. So the drive modes will actually let you choose... Um, the excite mode is more for if you want to be sporty, but the fuel conserve mode is called conserve. Normal is your effortless and balanced mode. Then you have a, a bad weather mode for rain or ice or snow. And then you have a deep condition mode if you're in mud or sand. So that's some newer technology that was uh, not available on the Nautilus that has been out for a few years on the Corsair and on the aviator other nice thing are your seat controls which are up on your door 
a lot easier access to uh, adjust your seating you do have memory seating which is nice and like I said your cup holders and it's lit up at night so you can see see well the second row seats are adjustable as well which you don't have on the Nautilus so hopefully I like that you can adjust the leg room there's a metal bar underneath the seat when someone's sitting down uh, the rear seats are heated if they need to be in there's power connections for the rear passenger and these rear seats recline so it makes it comfortable and you've got the panoramic roof with the cover and plenty of storage in the back but I just want to take a few minutes uh, get you a good overview it runs on 87 gas uh, it is all-wheel drive and it has a little nicer engine they call it the 2.3 liter EcoBoost where you only have the 2.0 on the standard models on both the Nautilus and the Corsair but I think the sport package and the technology upgrades will be nice you also have a wireless phone charger which is nice I think hopefully you had that in there um, besides all weather mat they also wanted a mat for the back so this is included they already got a Corsair cargo mat for the rear and you've got line storage instead of just the styrofoam bins like on the Nautilus and your spare then you can release the back seats from here which is nice so if I need to fold down these seats I'm putting in groceries or loading something then I can just do that I've got the front seats back a little bit but and I can adjust and program the height of this rear but being that the t they actually designed this it's hydroformed so it wraps all the way around and makes makes it look very elegant uh, but I have it secure for you with your deposit and I will email you over the credit app and the items I need like copy of the driver's license and registration that way like I said we can have the car detailed and ready filled up with gas and bring the paperwork with this when Carson comes uh, to show you the vehicle and we can inspect and get the Nautilus bring whatever lease turn in paperwork we need but I definitely appreciate all your time Bob and your business Mike Murdoch Bozard Lincoln 904-334-9889 uh, we appreciate uh, all your time Saturday and we look forward to talking to you soon have a great day bye bye